I'm going to show you how to make an amazing splash screen with animation in Android Studio exactly like this app. Hello my friends and welcome to the complete Android developer course and master coding channel. Let's move to Android Studio and start building this one million dollar application. Just kidding. So prepare your coffee, hit like and subscribe below, rate us five stars on Udemy and let's go. First of all, we have created a new project in Android Studio. And let's now move to the drawables. I have created these images and the XD folder. You can check them in the uh, Udemy course uh, attachment and the uh, uh, images are available in the description below. Let's paste them into the drawable folder. Okay. And then select the project. And here we go. These are for the different size uh, for the screen sizes. Now I will copy one of them called back.png and place it in the drawable folder in order to specify it. So remove the text view in the main activity layout. And I will search for the background and I will select our uh, background called back.png. It's not found in the drawables I, uh, because uh, there is uh, many uh, sizes. I will copy one of them and paste it in the drawable. So uh, drawable, uh, Android have uh, uh, an intelligence uh, uh, that decides and uh, uh, determines the size of the screen and display the correct uh, image size and resolution for each device. For now, I have uh, copied uh, into the main drawable folder uh, and I will select the Pixel 6.0. Let's see for the bigger devices. Um, let's see 6.3. Okay, 6.0 is good. Okay. Okay, let's see Pixel 2. Okay, this is good. Now, uh, let's drag and drop in a button and add the constraints for that button and switch it, it below. And later on in this video, we are going to uh, con configure and change the background of this uh, button and see how uh, uh, we uh, use uh, uh, shapes in Android Studio. So let's add some constraints and th uh, some uh, margins like here. I remove the text and create login. Let's see it is uh, get started. Get started is better. You can uh, make it uh, whatever you want. Get started. Okay. And we are going to drag and drop the two texts. I will uh, make them uh, from the top, far from the top, about 60, in, uh, 60 or 62 uh, pixels, maybe 90. Let's see the size of it. Let's see 24. 30 is good. And let's uh, change it for the family. Uh, but before we uh, let's uh, change the text. Welcome to master coding channel. This is the text view. I need to put it uh, for the gravity in the center. I uh, search for gravity and select the gravity to center. Okay. So it's till now we are doing fine. Okay, adding some uh, constraint uh, for the width and the height. And uh, let's make it 16, which is better. Okay, now I'll change the text. Please subscribe. I will add it uh, for another uh, text. Maybe it would be better, but first uh, let me see. Okay. It would be uh, better to make a new text for please subscribe to get more t 
tutorials okay it will be uh, fine okay so welcome to master coding and I'm just editing okay you see in Android there uh, and in applications the user interface would be uh, uh, good but there is a better so we uh, uh, for it is very uh, important advice for every uh, app you are making and you are going to make please search for the better and the best user interface you uh, look like and you would gain more installs and more uh, success so for that we see that uh, one text view would be uh, like uh, not good or uh, maybe uh, five or six stars over ten but there is better uh, better uh, ui uh, configuration so i will split them into two texts first text will be bold and the second text would be would be uh like normal text but there is a there is a uh, an awesome user interface and looking for that uh, this contrast so look look again if we see the the, uh, the font and the background it would be better now so uh look always for the better user interface remember if you love your app the user will love your app so if you look uh, if your your app uh, if you look at your app and say hey uh, there is, it's good but there is a better and you don't do the better remember and be uh, be, uh, be uh, like uh, absolutely it would not gain the results that you are expecting because you are not expecting and not making your app a professional so you don't have a professional results so the user interface is a very important and the design of the application is very important uh, for uh, for the users to be uh, confident to be uh, like uh, like feel for satisfaction like feel for not uninstalling your app so after a big experience with our application that called master coding and master android and master flutter or are uh, all are on play store you can download them free from our application uh, our uh, play store or sorry google play store uh, we have the big lesson about is taking care for the user interface so this application this small application will will learn you a big uh, lessons about user interface and how to make a professional app that the users will keep them on your uh, on their devices so look again we have changed the text and it our application now looks better so start making a professional look uh, apps and you can send us to our uh, uh, email and uh, on Udemy, uh, you can open discussion. So I can advise you, I can help you with your uh, projects and even on YouTube, uh, please uh, comment below. So I can help you, my team uh, can help you in user interfaces and detecting the problems and the better things for your application. Now I have created a shape on the drawable folder called round underscore corner and I pasted this code just copy and paste it no need uh, to uh, uh, to understand it because the the previous video or uh, sorry uh, no need to lecture it now because in the previous videos I have uh, I have uh, lectured and make a video about how to make and customize the background for the buttons and the other uh, widgets now I will specify the background for it but the background of, uh, of this app or sorry this uh, round corners are uh, black and the same as the background I would change it to uh, white white will look good and here we go it's now 
now uh, it's uh, making contrast with the, with the black I will change the color of the text text color and make it white now it's look good so guys it is very important lesson to 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 use uh, the best things and make a professional application is a uh, user interface again user interface it's very important step now let's add the animation for animations it's very uh, it's uh, first time i show you how to use animation so first of all let's create a new resource a folder called android resource, uh, resource uh, directory and called anime so search for above for uh, anime and here we go now let's create an animation resource file and call the file name would be uh, like animate or um, yes animate from our oh, animate uh, button you can uh, name it whatever you want I advise you to uh, name the, uh, the files uh, as their function so animate bottom it will be used for animating the bottom not the text of use for this files we are going to use a, a, a tag called translate so this translate will translate the widgets along the x and y uh, algorithm or uh, pixels uh, and axis and make it translated uh, by using the next codes android equal duration 2000 milliseconds or two seconds and android from delta would be 100 and percentage p so this is the the way we can translate the android widget or anything in the android studio using android from delta and we use the percentage p now android from from y delta uh, x delta and zero percentage p we don't need to uh, push it along sides of uh, or diagonally we need to uh, push it from below to upside using this algorithm will be from 0 to 100 and we see later on on the text views how to use the uh, the x and the y uh, uh, axis back to the main activity we are going to initiate the button and I will create an animation an instance uh, I will create an object of instance animation called animate button and in the on create uh, on create method I will instantiate the button and uh, the uh, find view by id r dot id dot button now button this is let's see okay button id is called button okay removing this and the button now let's add the animation animate button animate button that we have created a this object of an instance um, this object uh, or instance of the class animation would be uh, initialized by calling animation utils dot load animation and passing the context as the first parameter in the constructor and the second parameter r dot anim dot animate button these are the animations that we are passing for through the constructor of the animation utils dot load animation or calling the method load animation sorry now button dot set animation and i will set it the animate button i will start the avd the virtual device but first of all let's create an animation for the text views in the same way i will copy and paste the animation for this text views this called text view 
and the second is text view two. Now, let's go text view. Text two. And call T1 equal find view by ID and find it by R dot ID dot text view. Okay. And in the same way, T2 text view number two. Okay. So I will create another one called animate animate text underscore text and I will copy paste the previously written uh, codes but here uh, it, it, there is one uh, thing to change I will change from X to Y from X Delta and from Y Delta because the text views will be appeared from the top and go down to appear at the top of the uh, activity. Uh, inversely, or in the controversy of the uh, for the, uh, the 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 button that appears from below to the, the from the bottom of the uh, activity. Now. Copying and pasting the codes, changing the changing the appropriate appropriate uh, animations, and T1 called set animation animate text, and T2 dot set animation and for the animate underscore text. Okay, let's see uh, duration. I am changing the duration. For the text 1000 and the button would be 2000 the text will appear first and then the button will appear at the, se the second uh, or the next second okay till now it's very clear and very uh, very easy now let's run and see and here we go but the text there is still the same. What is the error? Uh, okay. T T2 here. Okay. Let's run again. And here we go. The text first appear and the secondly with we appeared by the button. So guys, it's very important to uh, to concentrate on the UI of the of the uh, your app and every app you make you can practice ui uh, examples and professional material design uh, applications in the next videos on our youtube channel and the complete android developer course and all core uh, all source codes are available on udemy and the xd file would be available on udemy and the source codes also on the on udemy course please hit subscribe and get the free coupon from below and subscribe to our youtube channel uh, and like our videos so you support us making new videos and don't miss to rate us five stars on Udemy so you keep making uh, making uh, us making new videos thank you guys see you in the next video